Praveen Giri is asking managing a small scale hospital versus large bigger scale hospital in the present scenario, present era of COVID, uh, following norms of NABS, so unable to do low scale pricing package in, in MediClaim. Is GP support necessary for a high flow of patient without them getting more patient extra? Okay, a lot of, <laughs> lot of dot, dot, dots. Managing small scale hospital versus large or bigger scale hospital in present situation, present era of COVID. Is following norms of NABH so are unable to do. Are you here, Praveen Ji? Praveen Giri, if you are here, please raise your hand. You can unmute yourself. You can understand the context better. Yeah. Answer them. It depends, like if you are uh, if you have not run any any uh, setup till now, small scale is is to is the right way of going. It do not plunge into directly into bigger scale. If you're already running a small scale, you want to ex expand. Uh, there is always a correct time. Okay, this is every correct time is now. Okay, do not worry about the situation here and there. Don't worry a lot of things. This country needs a lot of hospitals, lot of people, medical healthcare. So if you're building uh, some, something in a, in a proper way, marketing in right way, approaching people in right way, you're understanding the need, it will be successful. It depends on how much experience you have. So it is important that uh, what is your present situation and then from there, from, where, from there you can jump to the next level. Following norms, right. NAVH and so on. Just keep the new setup lean. You should not overspend so that you are in debt. Correct. And a low skill pricing package in MediClaim um, that you can you can decide uh, which MediClaim you want to like approve of, which you cannot. It depends on your capacity. Okay. And it depends upon your facility also. Sometimes rather than getting it wasted, it is better that you get something out of it. Yeah. Even if it is a like break-in situa situation, at least yeah. you the property yeah. utilized. And if GP support necessary for high flow patient, it depends. Okay. If you have a strong brand, that is what we are telling to everyone here, make a strong personal brand so that the, all GPs don't have a capacity to negotiate with you. You should they don't do a, a branding properly. This situation cannot change. Yeah. Because unless and until you are getting a direct inflow of patients, you will not have a, a position of power of negotiation. You should negotiate from the power, power position of power. And that, can, that can come only if you have a good brand, uh, a, a strong brand, and that can be built over years. And this digital era gives you an opportunity to build brand very easily in a, like one and two years if you can do it properly. So build a brand. Yes, initially GP, GP support is necessary. And it, is good. it is good. It is a referral fees. You just think it is a referral fees you are giving and grow with, with them and slowly, slowly reduce that component and get the direct flow. Okay.